Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. So today I am going to do a sword and shield opening, I guess. Um, not sword and shield base, but different sets in sword and shield, obviously. Um, so we have Fusion Strike, Brilliant Stars, Astro Radiance, Lost Origin, and Silver Tempest. Um, I am going to open them in that order. That is the order in which they were released. Um, so I'm going to open them that way. I don't know, just because, I guess, nothing really, you know, it's not, I don't know. It's just what it is, I guess. So, we're going to start with that. I'm actually going to do that. And we're going to start with Fusion Strike. Um, I've been putting this together for a while. And I've had these for a while. Um, because I did order all of these from the Pokemon Center. Um, I don't know, maybe two, three months ago. And it's kind of just been here. And mainly, a lot of the time that happens because, um, like, there's a lot of different sets coming out or different products coming out. And, of course, here on the channel, I'm going to open um, products that I see worth my money and budget-friendly for me. And, you know, so when there's a lot of things coming out, that's what gets opened instead of things like this so obviously they're still going to be opened but you know so we have a deoxys which is nice this um these are building battle kits i don't think i said that but that is what we're opening today so all of these will have some type of promo in here and these actually don't have as many cards in them as everything else does and then each build and battle kit comes with like a little it's not a booklet but like a little sheet that tells you how to build and then it also comes with a set list on the back so i don't use these i think i only have one of these for um evolutions and that's it so these only have four packs in them and you know what? I'm actually going to open these because they have the codes in them. And I'm going to at some point take out the, take them out anyway, because I'm going to use, we're well not use, but get the promos out of there. So there is a code. And then here is my promo, which I'm going to sleeve. And they are promos. They are Black Star promos, as you can see right there. So we'll go in my promo binder. That's trash right there. And then you will use these to make your, um, oh my gosh, I am blinking right now. You will use these to make your deck when you go to build and battle or when you go to um, pre-release tournaments. So not all of them are Fusion Strike. That is a Fusion Strike symbol. But then you also had this one, which is from Rebel Clash. Um, that's Sword and Shield Base, Sword and Shield Rebel Clash. So yeah, so you will take these. And sometimes you do have to look through them because they will have like promo trainers in there. And I found one actually, and I don't know like where it came from. I don't remember where it came from. But I did not, I'm sure I don't have those promo trainers from anywhere else. So, okay, so there we go. I did put those to the side and I was like, oh, because I didn't know. So, yeah. Yep, yep, yep. I know that's like, sounds like a lot of rambling. And it's not meant to be that way, but sometimes to get the video started off properly, that's what I got to do. So, <laughs> We have a Pan Sage, Q Font, Gligar, Slugma, Skitty, Reverse Hollow Fusion Strike Energy, and a Non Hollow Corbonite. So all of these have four packs in them. Um, what did I do? Oh, I actually got some of these when I. I bought a bundle to get the Pikachu and Eevee um, promos. And then I bought the rest of them. Y'all see that? What is that? Right there. 
That's weird. All right, we have a fighting energy, metapod, Persian, power tablet, which is what that's on the back of. I don't know what that is. Tynamo, Galarian Meowth, Gossifleur, Panpour, Eevee, Reverse Hollow Beware, Non Hollow, um, Levini, Levini, however you're supposed to say that. Okay. I definitely am missing um, plenty of cards from all of these sets, honestly. I'm pretty sure at this point, except for. Well, no, I have the Fusion Strike, actually. Um, what is it? Astral Radiance. I don't have Astral Radiance in my Collector's app. So I don't know exactly how much of that set I have collected so far. But all of the rest of them, I have definitely gotten over halfway. So I'm just missing cards. Okay, y'all, I be hearing stuff. Every video, I hear something, and I guess it just might be like, I don't know, just whatever happens in the home. I don't know. I know I'm not making sense, but yeah. Reverse Hollow Skarmory and a Holographic alligator. Okay. So it doesn't look like we're going to be getting much out of Fusion, but hopefully we get some good hits out of other places. Hopefully. There's stuff everywhere. All right. So we have a Psychic Energy, Farewell Bell, Galarian Linoon, Stantler. I feel like I've never seen that Stantler. Stuffle, Sandy Gast, Plusle, Vulpix, Melton, Reverse Hollow Tynamo, non-holographic play doll so nothing in there so now we're going to move on to our brilliant stars brilliant stars does have and i'm not sure about fusion strike actually um but they do have a i think it's called a galarian gallery in this set i think maybe no it's a trainer gallery in this set why is this so hard to take off like Okay, so again, you have your um, set list. We have a Lucario, which I already have. I am missing one of them, though. I just don't know which one. But I'm missing one of these promos. So I'm going to have to get another, probably. And I am going to open this one. How did I open that other one so easily? Right, so you have your oops, more trash. You have your brilliant star stamped Lucario there, and then you see this deck is bigger than the last one. Here's a code, and then we have our energies, just so you guys can see what's in them. And then this is the actual brilliant stars um, set stamp. I think that's from, I can't think of it right now. It's one that I didn't collect a whole lot of. That's Evolving Skies. Y'all. Yeah. Okay, so that's that. And I'm gonna sit that over here. And then we're gonna open our four packs. It's like, I feel like every time I record, it gets like really cold. And I'll be hearing stuff, but maybe I'll be hearing stuff because like the air is kicking on and it's like moving things. I don't know. But yeah, it's a little creepy when you like just are by yourself, I guess. All right. So we have Fighting Energy again. Executor, Weavile, Friends in Galar, Starly, Shroomish. Piplup, I feel like I see something back there, y'all. I hope so. Um, Encino, Carablast, Reverse Hollow Clefable, 
end up burying full art trainer. Not that I'm upset about it, but I'm pretty sure I have this berry. <laughs> but I will definitely take it because a hit is a hit, okay? So I'm going to put that there. That's our first hit too. So let's see what else we can get out of here. Maybe we get some momentum going. Let's see, have a lightning energy, Sigilith, Marnie's Pride, Upside Down Torkoal, Weasel, Gibble, which is, I don't know what happened there, but Gibble, Mencino, Care Blast, Weasel, Reverse Hollow Hunting Gloves, and a Arceus V, nice. I don't think I have this one actually because the color, like the background of it is not ringing a bell, but that is amazing. All right, definitely got some momentum, just a little bit. Keep them coming, keep them coming. I am missing, um, I think there was like three or four Charizards in this set, I think. I think and I'm missing I think two of them I think I have two and I'm missing two so definitely need those Gibble Trap Hinch Execute Starling Shroomish Reverse Hollow Cleansing Gloves Non Holographic Mewtwo so our first pack with no hit it'd be nice to pull a trainer gallery though just so you know, for those of you who may be new and these are older sets to you, um, you can see what I'm talking about. Or if you're just new to the, you know, the hobby. So, Pachirisu, Plunder Policy. I think I said that right. Blunder Policy. I definitely did not say that right. <laughs> the Dene, Cub Chew. Shinx, Farfetch'd, Execute, Reverse Hollow Shinx, Non Holographic Al Creamy. So two out of four, not bad. So I'm gonna put these. Whoops, I'm gonna fix it. Hold on. I'm trying to make sure I have room for all of the stacks that I'm about to put over here. So now we're gonna get into our Astral Radiance. Same thing. In all of the building battles, there's always going to be one of the the um, set lists. So if you don't buy, let's say, the ETBs for the booklet, and that's what I do, then why well, buy both, really? But you will always have a set list in here. We have a Weird Ear, which I feel like I have, but I'm not too sure. And then we have our four packs. So I'm going to open this one also so I can give you the code out of here. And the codes that I'm giving you guys are the codes for the building battle kits. I don't know exactly what you get in them if you play the online TCG game. But, you know, a code is a code. And I know a lot of people do come here and people like codes. So I'm going to give them out. We have our weirdier right there and then we have our energies which i really need to just set these to the side because i want to bulk those out and then we have all of the cards that will help us make excuse me our um I don't know why I keep forgetting the word, but yes. Okay, let's get into some astral. Again, I don't know how far along in this set I'm in. And I'm pretty sure I've definitely like put this set in order and have it set in an ETB box, but apparently I have not logged it. So I need to do that at some point. So that I'm caught up with everything. But I am actually working on that as well. 
Hesuian Growlithe, Bergemite, um, Reverse Hollow, Unidentified Fossil, and then a Non Hollow Rigid Drago. So, yes, 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 yes. I am working on that, working on binders. Speaking of, there was a brand new binder. I walked into um, GameStop over the weekend, um, last weekend when I was ordering my contacts. No, actually that was Monday. On Monday, and they had a new binder. Um, there was a Pikachu and, I want to say it was a Pikachu and a Morpeko on the front, and then there was two Pokemon on the back. So I definitely want to pick that up and put some sets in there. Um, but yeah, I have been working on binders and things, so I'm trying, you guys. I'm really trying to stay organized, and it's hard to do when there's sets coming out back to back, and I don't have the time. That's a cute Stantler card. Reverse Hollow Zisu, Zisu, and Holographic Arita. So, yeah, I will be doing a binder video at some point. I was supposed to do one in December. And I just felt like I didn't have enough binders to do them. So I think I let down a few people because some people actually do like want to see binders. And it's not that I don't want to show you guys, but I don't like to put out stuff if I'm not prepared. And I felt like for a binder video with all the sets that I have, I was not prepared at all. So I want to get a little more prepared, which is why I bought those Vault X binders and I need to get some more because I can fit a few sets in those um, because I bought the big XL ones that hold like 640, 640 cards in them. So a little expensive, but I mean, it's worth it because I think those were like 32 a piece maybe. So definitely worth it. We have a Suyan Quillfish, Petalil, uh oh, a Nicket, Reverse Hollow, a Zelf, and oh, Temple of Sinnoh, Gold Card. That's nice. And that is a Murkrow. That looks like a shiny Murkrow. There you go. Now maybe you can see it, but yes. Very nice. I know I don't have this card. I'm pretty sure I don't have any golds or before this one, no golds um, in this set at all. So very nice. Okay. And then our last pack of Astro. We, maybe we can get one more hit out of here because Fusion Strike did us wrong. It really did. Fusion Strike in Evolving Skies and Silver Tempest. Silver Tempest can be hard too. Um, those are some hard sets to get cards from. So, Hasuian Growlithe, Birdmite, Rufflet, Ponyta, that's pretty. Chatot, Reverse Hollow Thievil, and Non Holographic Mammoth Swine. So, at least we got a gold card out of it. So, if you are new here, um, number one, thank you guys for clicking on this video. Um, new or not but if you are new i like to pull all of my cards i don't like to buy them just yet if i can still find the set then i'm going to buy more of that set and i'm going to try to pull them until i cannot buy them anymore um for me cannot buy them is like the set isn't readily available or um it might be available at some card stores but because it's an older set it's like super expensive and because I, because I um, open packs, you know, on YouTube, certain things just don't work for me. So I have to do what I have to do. And yeah, but I like to open packs. I am a let me open my packs type of gal. I was trying to find the simpler way to open this, but I guess not. So... Okay, this ain't working. <laughs> Come on, it should not be this hard. And I can feel me like peeling up. There we go. Something. Okay. That was like the hardest thing in the world to do right there. So we have a Machamp. 
Not sure if I have that one though. I'm really not. And then we have all of our cards that are here. They put so many energies in here, but you do need those though. So then you have some from Brilliant Stars, Astral, This is Lost Origin right here. So, yep. And then we have our four packs over here. I'm shocked we still have not gotten like a trainer gallery from anything. We literally have not gotten a trainer gallery from none of these sets, and they all have them. So that's funny. All right, let's see what we can get out of Lost Origin. Um, I know a really big card in here is that Giratina. That is the card that people want to pull out of here, and I don't have it, so... I'm sure I'm not going to get that lucky today, but if I do, I would be very grateful. <laughs> we have a ducklet, a roof, rock roof. I was going to say a rufflet. That's, I was just in a rhyming mood, I guess. Seal. We have a radiant Hisuian Sneasler. That's nice. And then a non-holographic Cramorant. That's very nice. I like the radiant cards. I actually was showing one of my kids, um, one of my students. I don't have actual children but one of my students um my pokemon binder that i was talking about and um i showed it to him today and he was like oh my gosh and i was telling him why i had them because i was trying to help another student um it's like a, a reward system with my duplicates basically until i decide to sell them or whatever um and he was like, oh, well, can I do something like that? And I was like, I don't know. I have talked to your parents about that. I, you know, have talked to that student's mom. So I was able to come up with that with his teacher. But anyway, he was um, looking through. He was like, oh, this one's shiny. And he was like, well, what's the difference between a Radiant and an Amazing Rare? And da, 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 da. So we had went through those um, because I had a Radiant Charizard in there. Um, there was an amazing rare syllabi. There was a, I think a radiant Jirachi. Yeah, it was just a bunch of different things. He was like, what are these? So it was cool to do that. Reverse hollow Hasuian Basculin. I was going to say that so wrong. And a hollow Trevenant. But that's what that reminded me of because I don't have any radiant Sneezlers in there. But at the same time, I don't think I pulled a whole lot of them either. I know there's a, it was a Radiant Steelix, I think, was in there. That was one of them. But yeah. All right, let's see. We have what, this is the second to last pack of Lost Origin. Can we get one more hit maybe out of these two packs? Clefairy. Lickitung, Horsey, Shuppet, Reverse Hollow Apom, In and Iskin, or Iskin, I'm not really sure how to say it. I want to say it's Iskin, Trainer. I do have this one. I'm pretty sure I have this one because I don't think there's a lot of um, Iskin cards out there. But I'm pretty sure I do have this one. Very nice. So I at least did get the one more hit. And then we have this last pack here of Lost Origin. Um, this Gardevoir that's on this pack, I don't think I have any of those either. <laughs> so, I don't know what I'm going to do with these, like the set list. But I think if I ever was to do like card shows, I would probably let um, people get them. Um, for those who are like trying to complete sets and maybe they don't have a booklet or maybe they're trying to keep up with what they have and what they need, um, that's another way to do that. So I just use two different methods um, with mine. I use the booklet and I use the collector's app. So if something happens with my collector's app, because I've had it happen before with different apps, um, I have a backup and I have to go through all of it all over again. Reverse hollow wind up arm in a non holographic spirit tune. We're doing better than I thought we were going to do because I don't have a lot of great luck 
with building battles and sometimes they're very much so hit or miss like i've opened some that were just straight no hits at all so like the fusion strike one but imagine open like three fusion strikes and you get no hits at all <laughs> so we are on to our last building battle which is silver tempest i didn't open a lot of silver tempest building battle kits so i think this would be my first or second maybe so we have a sun flora y'all i'm telling y'all and usually i don't open these on camera i really don't i usually just um just sit them back there but what's the point because then afterwards it's kind of like okay well i opened it and now there's this um Come on, ow. All right, so I just stabbed myself with scissors. Don't do that, friends. <laughs> I then just have like this cold card that I don't know what to do with, so I have to figure it out. So there is the code. And then here is our Sun Flora stamped promo. So we have all of our energies, which wasn't a lot actually, unless they're mixed in there. We have Rotom, Zero Aura, this is the Silver Tempest stamp. That's um, Fusion Strike, that is Chilling Rain right there, Evolving Skies. Okay, and the V-Star, so. There we go, put those there. All of that's gonna go in bulk because I don't need any of it. And then we have our last four packs of the video. Thank you guys so much if you made it this far. Hope that you guys have enjoyed it. I know it's been like very chatty about different things, but I hope that you guys enjoyed it and maybe you want to comment on something that I said or add something to it, which is great. Um, you're more than welcome to do that down in the comment section. Love to see it and hear from you guys. I always do. Um, yeah, so go ahead and drop some comments down there. I'm gonna move that set to over there so I have some space because I'm right-handed, so I put my cards on the right side. And it's just not enough space on this table right now. We have a Halucha Reverse Hollow Archin. In an unknown V. So I do not have this one. I think I'm missing one of the unknowns. Um, Cause there's an unknown, there's an unknown V star. And I think there's two unknown V stars, I think. And I think I only have one. So, okay, got it. But yeah, thank you guys so much for clicking on the video and watching this far. I hope Hopefully you guys like it. This is a longer video and I do try to mix it up. I don't do a lot of long, very long videos, but I do want to do more. It just takes time for me to get all of the things that I want for those videos. So thank you for being patient and rocking with me because it means a lot. Um, so yeah, and help me keep moving forward, please. And thank you. <laughs> Reverse Hollow Wilmer and non holographic Fion or Peon. I don't know. So I have two left. Also, if you're not subscribed, go ahead and subscribe, especially if you're new or a returning viewer. Love to see it. I have been seeing that a lot um, of my subscribers have been coming back and watching my videos. So thank you guys for that. Took a minute to get that to happen, but it has been happening for the past few videos. And I really do appreciate it. I did mention that in one of my recent videos also. Um, so that's a good, lets me know that you guys like the content and you're, you know, waiting for more. So that's great. Um, and I appreciate everything that you guys are doing here for me. Talking to me here, talking to me on Instagram. Love it all. I respond to everything. As long as I see it, sometimes I don't see them or sometimes I think people come in at the same time and it'll show me one but not another. So it takes some time. Sometimes I just go in there and I'm like, oh, I didn't see that. And it's like five hours ago. So 
give me time, but I will respond. Um, I just have to see it to respond to it. <laughs> Reverse Hollow Dragapult in Non Holographic Braviary. Okay, last pack. Hopefully, we get some last pack magic because, again, like I said, these are these sets are hard to get stuff in. And I already have that unknown V, and I would like to have something else, something that I don't have. But that's what we all want. We all want something that we don't have. So let's see if we can get it. I feel like it's dark. I don't know. Maybe it's just dark to me. I'm not sure. But Indeedy, Ball Toy, Sun Kern, Clink, Reverse Hollow Smeargle, Holographic Dragonite. So... We at least did get one hit out of the four packs um, for everything except Fusion Strike. Um, Fusion Strike is a hard set, though, I think, to me. But I think my top favorites today would be this beautiful Arceus V. Absolutely love it, and I'm pretty sure it's new. I do like the berry, but not in my top three. I like the Temple of Sinnoh, the gold, which is great because we all love a gold card. And then I do like this Iskin over here. I don't know. He just looks friendly. So thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video. Um, let me know whatever you want me to know in the comment section down below. Let me know what you guys want to see. Um, we will be opening Charizard boxes as soon as they get here. Um, I mentioned them in the last video. Um, and you can pre still pre-order those almost everywhere. So if you don't have one and you want to pre-order it, go ahead and do that. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video.